guys welcome back to my channel so today I am doing another video an updated version of a video that I want to say was the first video I posted on YouTube um, this is gonna be my updated skincare routine because let's just say the last skincare uh, video that I posted um, yeah I kind of felt like uh, it was drying out my skin and it was making me more oily and I don't want to be oily so I had a coupon for Ulta because it was my birthday last week and I was like you know what I'm running low on my cleanser I want to go and figure this shit out because I'm oily as fuck in my t-zone I don't like it like I can't wear makeup anymore because it just rolls the fuck off when I put glasses on and that ain't cute so I went in there and I figured out like what it is and I basically got all new everything for my skincare and we're gonna do it today and I'm going to uh, basically do my skincare this is like a day and night skincare routine so I'm gonna show you how I basically control the oil on my face while washing my face and also preventing wrinkles at the same time because bitch I still want to look like I'm 12 when I'm 60 okay great so my cleanser that I use is Dermalogica Dermal Clay Cleanser um, this is basically it purifies oily skin it has kaolin green clays with purifying extracts some viscous ivy lemon to remove excess oil and refine the skin's texture it has calming cucumber and sage soothe while refreshing uh, menthol revitalizes even the most tired skin oh it's got menthol that's why it feels all cooling when i wash my face i'm shook so and i still use the Clarisonic Mia 2. This brush head is actually a pore like um, cleanser. It helps to clean out clogged pores. So they, uh, for Clarisonic, they have like different kinds of brush heads. One for anti-aging, one for pimples, one for dry skin, and so I got the one for pores. So I'm gonna get my brush head wet with warm water and then and this Mia 2 is has an automatic timer of two minutes because two minutes is how bleh, two minutes is how long you should be spending on washing your face yeah two minutes is how long you should be washing your face for not 30 seconds like I used to so I'm gonna go in and basically wash my face for a few minutes. and I didn't read the back but it has a cooling like sensation when you wash your face so that's what I guess that's what the menthol is because menthol is like cooling so it's very like uh, cooling when you wash your face feels really weird at first but on it I thought it was because I was having an allergic reaction to the cleanser but no so I'm dabbing my face dry you don't want to like rub your face because um you'll drag your skin and you don't want that 
so all right <clears throat> and now it's a great dry my hairline is wet oh well so now we are gonna go in with the origins zero oil pore purifying toner it has supplemental and mint and it's basically like it purifies your pores um and it's a toner bitch i'm using a toner where why like what the fuck no i have to because i guess apparently the toner uh, it like gets more of the dirt off of your skin like it cleans your face more and because this is a uh, pore purifier it helps with uh, like reducing the uh, reducing the excess oil on your skin so yeah origins zero oil pore purifier uh, I want to say this was like $20 and then the cleanser was like $32 because it's like a big ass bottle. This is uh, 8.4 fluid ounces. So I'm going to take this on a cotton pad and just basically rub this all around my skin. But mostly I'm going to spend the most time on my nose because that's where I feel like the oil is the most. Mm. and just basically like oh i don't know what the point is of is i don't know what the point of a toner is i i just i honestly because i'm very minimalistic i'm very just like let me wash my face let me put on a white stranger and then i'm good but no apparently in order for me to still look like i'm 12 when i want to be 60 I have to like have this excess like skincare regimen and I'm just like like honestly growing up I used to always make fun not make fun but I used to always be like what the fuck like to my grandma having like a nine step skincare routine and I'm not joking when I say nine step like my grandma was trying to combat more wrinkles than what she already had and her skincare routine was like nine steps long it seemed like and she spent at least like 45 minutes in the bathroom when she got up because she did her skincare routine twice I didn't understand I didn't understand the point of doing it twice and then she spent 45 minutes at night and that included like brushing her teeth brushing her dentures like like the whole nine dog and I used to always be like what the fuck like why does my grandma have like all these steps for her skincare routine like why like she had one to take off her makeup she had one to like further clean off the makeup then she had her cleanser then after that she had a toner and then after that she had some other like thing to further clean her face after the cleanser and the toner and then she had like four moisturizers and i'm just like what the like but now i understand it's like because you're preventing like all the pollutants because apparently like the pollutants and like all the nasty dirt and debris from the day can like really like fuck up your skin so that is my cotton pad with all the dirt the excess dirt i got off you can't see because this lighting is fucking the worst i swear to fucking god so then oh and then twice a week i go in with the juice beauty stem cellular resurfacing micro exfoliant because the lady that i was talking to told me that i need to exfoliate my skin twice a week so that the natural oils can like produce in my skin okay bitch sure and then <clears throat> to moisturize my skin i'm going in with the origins ginseng energy boosting gel moisturizer uh the lady was telling me that because I was using a cream, it was basically clogging my pores and that um, it was like, it basically was producing more oil on my nose than what it went then normal. And that I have to use a gel moisturizer because it's gonna be a lot lighter 
on my pores and it won't clog my pores as much so I'm just gonna take this all over my skin and kind of really just focus it more on my nose and then under my eyes I like to go in with my ring fingers because those are the lightest to touch and really just get that in there and it and it has like a citrus scent to it it's kind of like this can't see but it's like I don't know it's like a gel moisturizer I don't know how to explain it and then at night this is what makes it like how I turn it into like a nighttime skincare routine I do the same thing with the Dermalogica the origins and then the origins moisturizer and then what I like to mix in with the origins moisturizer is the Dermalogica overnight repair serum bitch you know I had to mix in an anti-aging somewhere in the skincare. I'm not gonna like not anti-age at fucking all. No. So this is the overnight repair serum. Uh, it basically maximizes nighttime skincare skin repair to help reduce fine lines, renew resilience, yes, bitch, and increase luminosity by morning. So basically. What you do is you tilt this bottle upside down for two to three seconds because apparently like all the good anti-aging shits on the bottom. So you tilt it upside down for two to three seconds. It mixes. Then you do uh, four to six drops. You can use this by itself, but on here it says blend with your nighttime uh, cream. And so I usually do four to six drops and I mix it with my... And then I put a little bit of this in my hand and I mix it together. Oh, bitch. So, yeah, that is my updated skincare routine day and night because bitch told me I had to do it twice. And I'm calling her a bitch because I originally was going to do like a whole Mario Badassu like skincare routine. And the lady was like, Mario Badassu is for teenagers just dabbling into the skincare routine. And I'm like, what the fuck? Like, hello, do you not know that I have, like, Mario Badassu, everything? Like, like, I was so pissed off because this other nice guy was like, oh, yeah, Mario Badassu is, like, really great. Here's what you need. Like, he told me, he told me what they do. And this other girl was like, nah, nah, put it all back. Mario Badassu is for teenagers. And I'm like, why the fuck is there an age range for skincare? Like, let me live. So I'm, like really obsessed with the skincare routine because I've been doing this now for five days and I can already tell the difference like I can already tell there's like a 75 percent difference in the oil like reducage like I had a hundred percent oil on my nose to the point where my glasses were to here on me instead of to here and now there's like 25 percent left like, there is still oil, obviously, because it's hot outside, but it's not, like, dramatic. It's not, like, this, oh, my God, like, I have, like, so much oil that I can put it in a frying pan and make fucking fried chicken. No, I'm, I had that much oil that I could basically just take a Q-tip or whatever, scrape it off, and fry chicken with it. That's how bad it was. And now, I like, the oil has been so reduced. I've been using this for five days and I can already see a difference. Number two, underneath my eyes, they don't look as dry. I was starting to develop like dark circles underneath my eyes. And bitch wear. Like, and I can all, and they don't look as dry. My face looks a lot fucking better. It doesn't look as dry. It looks a lot more lumino luminous. It looks a lot more glowy. It looks fucking great. And I'm really fucking excited to this is like my everyday like my forever skincare routine now like dermalogica even though they're really expensive they're really fucking good like <sighs> so that is it for my skincare routine and the clarisonic mia too all of this stuff that i use for my skincare you can get it at ulta not lying the clarisonic i highly recommend because it's 20 times better than using your hands and using your hands yes it can clean your skin but the clarisonic cleans your hands like cleans your skin 20 times more than your hands so that is it for this video i hope you guys like this video as always 
share this with your cat because cats are the greatest thing on this planet. I wish I could have a cat, but I live here where we're not allowed to have cats slash someone's allergic. So unfortunately, I cannot have cats. But if you have any other animal than a cat, share this with them. They will love my videos just as much as cats do. Share this with your family, share this with your friends, share this on on social media, Snapchat, Instagram, Twitter, Vine, if you, on your podcast, if you have a podcast, shout me out on your podcast. If you want me to do an interview on your podcast, I'm here. I will do an interview on your podcast. So that is it for this video. I love you all and I will see you guys soon. Bye guys.